We're also excited for the holiday season and what those events can bring us. And so we're joined now at noon by Melanie Cox, who is actually a volunteer from the Beamit Community Council. And she's here to share with you two events who have both been designed to get us into the Christmas spirit, but also to come together as a community right after Thanksgiving. And so we're just going to dive right in. Melanie, thank you for being with us at noon. And thank of course, you, so you know, we're excited because Beamit is just beaming with pride and excitement with these events. Tell us more about them. Yes, I'm here to promote two events that are going on for BMENT. BMENT's located right in between Champaign and Decatur, so it kind of brings a nice small town charm to these events. Um, first, right around the corner, we have our Christmas tree lighting, which is in our Veteran Memorial Park. Right in the center of town, we have a huge evergreen, and we're going to be having a tree lighting event this Sunday at 6.30 p.m. Um, it's going to start off with free hot cocoa and cider and music, and then Santa's going to, going to arrive via fire truck oh. with a little bit of flair, and then he and Mrs. Claus are going to magically light our Christmas tree in the center of town for the beginning of our Christmas festivities. Talk so about magical. Yeah. Oh, and then the local choirs are going to burst into carols, too. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Melody. Yeah. Wow. Okay, so then that's Sunday, right? That's this Sunday at 630. Okay. And then um, and on December 9th, which December. is a Saturday, okay. we have a full day of events packed in for you. Mm -hmm. All day um, Christmas events. It's going to kick off with uh, breakfast with Santa. We're going to have pancake breakfasts. Mm -hmm. And that's going to start off at 8 o'clock in the morning and nine o'clock in the morning. Two chances. Two chances okay. to get in there, yeah, and get tickets for those. They're going kind of fast. Uh, I can only <laughs> And then we're going to have a town-wide um, uh, Christmas parade that will kick off downtown and kind of circle around the town, and that's going to have uh, Mr. and Mrs. Claus on it as well. And then if you want to meet back at the Village Hall after that, Santa and his wife are going to be there with more cookies and more oh. photo ops and more times to visit with Santa. Um, let's see, after your time with Santa, we also have another event going on simultaneously at the Lions Club. Okay. And so they're going to be having lunch for sale um, by the senior class parents, okay. as well as the whole place is going to be packed with vendors for Christmas shopping all throughout the afternoon. If they have money after Black yeah. Friday. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> That's right. Okay. And then last but not yes. least, the local Piatt County ROSC is hosting a free spaghetti dinner in their very merry Christmas board game night. So they're going to have games and they'll have a Christmas cookie decorating and obviously free dinner. And there is a, supposed to be some sort of surprise as Ooh, well. So A Christmas surprise. Yeah. So from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m., you've got events all day long on Sunday or Saturday, December 9th. Okay. I just have to say, your community reminds me of the Polar Express with all these types of events. <laughs> it just right. seems like so much magic and that's it's, right. It's gonna be special. So thank you for sharing all of this, Melanie.